Good morning again guys. Today is the countdown to Slapnook. Literally, I'm just gonna keep counting down shift after shift until it hits Sunday. Or at least Saturday night and then it's Slapnook. So yeah. But today's a weird day because normally on Mondays I'm not until at least five, but my uh, my boss is on holiday for two weeks, so uh, I've had to pick up like the odd sort of shift, so like the longer days. So I'm in all day today, so it felt so weird getting up this morning at like eight o'clock <laughs> well, nine o'clock on the when I got up. Yeah, it felt weird getting up at eight, nine o'clock on the Monday when I'm usually just like having a lane. Because last night I couldn't switch off because I think my body were used to just <sighs> like staying up on Sunday nights not when I'm not in. And for the past few Sundays anyway, I've not been working. It's like normally I had the day off. So it's kind of why at the same time I've normally got the day off and then until five. But a bit all day. But at least uh, this is yeah. This is nice to actually on the way to work. So that's one benefit on today. But yeah, like I said, how many shifts I got left? One, two, five shifts. Well, today plus four more. So yeah, five shifts till slam book. Let's just get it over and done with. But at least I'm off tomorrow as well, so that's one benefit. And I spoke to Pitts last night about uh, the coach thing that we were on about to slam dunk and we've all ag agreed it's kind of a better idea to stay with the train and miss the end of slam dunk because it might be busy because of traffic on the motorway yeah but we kind of agreed it might be better to get the train or oh, it is better to get the train because there'll be traffic on the motorway for one being in bank holiday weekend and two everyone's going towards Leeds anyway for slam dunk and we don't be stuck in traffic on the way there on the court so we're just going to stick with the train so yeah, there'll be no traffic on the train. It might be a busy train, but at least we're not going to get stuck in anything. We're just sticking with the train. But well, let's go and get this shift over and done with so at least I can have death tomorrow and hopefully I'll meet up with Pitts and get my new deck. But yeah, I'd sort of explain a bit more on my like, coach thing that I was in back with Slam Dogs where. Like, if we got the coach, it'd be like, well, even at 10 o'clock instead of 20 past 9 like we was going to on the train. Uh, it means we won't get to Leeds for at least an hour later than we would have. And then if we did it traffic, it's going to be a lot worse. So instead we are going to stick with the train. It means we have to be up a lot earlier at the train station. <laughs> a lot earlier, so I'm literally going to be like that. <sighs> Come the morning of slamming, it's going to be so much coffee needed. But yeah, the only benefit was the coach was the last coach out of Leeds went till midnight, so it meant we could get home a lot earlier. And there's a tram turned up and it's not in service. I don't get that. Yeah, why is it? I don't understand why a tram just turned up and not in service. At all. When the tram's supposed to be due now, and the tram that's supposed to be due now is that one that's not in service. That I don't get. But yeah, I'm about to start off. I got side distracted. Uh, slightly distracted by the tram. Yeah, we are not going with my coach but the only benefit like I said was you could see the end of slam dunk because the last coach doesn't leave Leeds till uh, one's at midnight and one's at one o'clock come Monday morning so it means you could see the end of slam dunk but we are going to have to miss like at least 20 minutes 25 minutes of slam dunk but uh, like we might have said we're better off staying with the train and like my mum and dad have said sticking with the train just in case we did hit traffic on the coach and my brother said the same thing I didn't really think of that till, uh, till they really mentioned it but I kind of still wanted to get the coach so we could get to see all the bands but it's just so awkward to figure out now so I'm just going to stick with the train get there on the train get there early hopefully get the wristbands early because there's no more queues and then have some time to go before slam when it starts at 1 o'clock so yeah at least we've kind of sorted a plan. Oh, well, we've got a plan now of getting the train still. I just need to pick up the tickets at some point this week because I bought them like three weeks ago and I still haven't picked them up. So I have to get to that. And I don't know where this train tram is, but the one that's just like I mentioned turned up and said no service was my tram. So I don't know where it is now. Ah, see you now. So I'll see you guys very shortly. Hey guys, well, there's a little bit more messing around now for Slam Up. <laughs> I kind of personally want to get the coach home so we can see like the end of Slam Up. We've never seen the end of Slam Up. We always have to leave early because of the train. 
I personally want to get the coach home and we can book the coach and get back home and just still get the train there. Like the tickets I've got for the train, I can't get any money back or anything like that, so I might as well use them. Get the train there and then get the coach home. So I'm thinking, and I agree, my brother agrees, and so does my other friend. Just waiting on a response from my other friend, if he's up mind as well. We can all get the coach home at midnight and see the end of up. So uh, see what he says, see if he answers his phone before I start work. So I literally got like 15 minutes before I start. See if he answers his phone, if not, I'll speak to him later and hopefully get the tickets booked by the end of today and we can get the coach home. See all slammed up for the first time in the fourth year of me going. <laughs> Is it third? Third year of me going or fourth, I can't remember. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I finish work in like nine, ten hours time. And I'll let you know what's happening. Hi right, guys, I finally finished work with the phone side. Finally finished work. It's been one of the longest but slowest days possible just because of how nice it actually has been all day. And at the minute it's still as you can see pretty bright and pretty warm. It's I'll show you, see how warm it is. It is at the minute. Let's find Sheffield. Nineteen degrees still. But tomorrow it's gonna to be twenty-two or twenty-one. It's just yeah, twenty-one. I'm looking at wrong day. Twenty-one tomorrow. So that's good for my day off, nice and warm. But Sean's not skating and uh, Gareth's not skating, but I think Pitts is, so I'm gonna get up early in the morning and give him a ring and see what his plan is. But everything's changed as well for Slam You know, as I mentioned this morning we were going on the coach. They haven't tried booking the coach, fully sold out. So all we're gonna do now is get the train there as we planned, train back. So I'm kinda glad I didn't cancel the tickets now. So yeah, train slam up, train back. So it's a good job. We checked before I did cancel. Otherwise we wouldn't have got there. But at the minute, I just wanna get home. So I'm gonna open get this tram. If you're doing 10 minutes, get home, edit, and then get up and go and enjoy a full day of skating tomorrow because it's going to be nice. I tell you that guys, it feels so good to be sat down. Fine. <sighs> well, I'm finally, finally nearly up. I just want to sleep for the entire week. I am so tired. Right, tomorrow... Oh yeah, stop going. Tomorrow... I don't know if you can see... Hang on. Sorry, I turned up the lights so you can see me. Yeah, tomorrow I just want to have a lie in because it's my day off. But uh, like I mentioned earlier, it's going to be so warm tomorrow, so I'm going to make most of the weather. Because I hate being indoors. Like, I always like to be out doing something. So when I do have like lazy days indoors, it's very rare. <laughs> so yeah, call it tomorrow, get to go out skating. But I'm going to call it night because I'm going to get in and edit. I get some food because I'm really hungry and finally get some sleep. So I will see you tomorrow as always. Night guys. Bye.